here's the project. We have this old hydraulic system here, and that's not going to change, but it's still going to be hydraulic. But this master valve, called Burmed, it's brand. It's going to be removed, and I'm going to be putting a uh, another master valve on the outside. So I got to. Uh, this is all brass and copper, so this thing's got to be spun off, and then I'm going to replumb down for all that copper and uh out here gonna have a a master valve a new master valve rainbird uh valve and then up here we're gonna have a a flow sensor it needs to be about three feet plus the master valve so i'm gonna need to dig a trench in this root filled ground to see this like trees everywhere so I'm gonna have to go about five feet up and uh three feet wide and three feet deep to uh, get down to who's not going to be fun so I better better get started on this well, I'm a few hours in now hard digging here roots rocks and a whole bunch of other pipes I <sighs> didn't really want to cut anything out yet until I have a plan together I found like huge root probably coming off this tree here that's like five feet away four feet away so excavating underneath and I take my reciprocating saw cut that sucker out but got this all dug down got it exposed so I can cut that off when I'm ready okay so if, actually some good news is I the pipe was just right there underneath that big root so I've cut it here uh, at the one end so I can well, actually both ends there's no ends <laughs> I've cut the pipe so I can <sighs> push it back underneath that root as that root is super jammed on top and uh, that way I can cut that root out of there and it should be a little bit easier to dig so once I get the root out I can dig back underneath and trim it up a little bit so I can put my valve box in there so every foot here is just a fight you can just see just full of roots, roots and rocks, and gotta scrape this material, cut the roots, and almost there, maybe another foot to go. I think I'm far enough back now, so got it to uh, cut this copper pipe here so I can start deconstructing this master valve. So I think if I cut the pipe there, I can twist, twist this off. Maybe I'll just cut it there too and actually if I cut it there I can just pop it out and it'll be done. So I gotta get my reciprocating saw and cut that copper. All finished. So got it all spliced up. We got our pipe going down underneath the blocks there and it comes back up and Got a branch line going down to our QCs that doesn't have to have the valve on, so we can use some hoses down in the garden. And we got our master valve for the uh, field irrigation. We've got a quick coupler back in place there to blow out the system, and there we have our uh, flow sensor. Just got to put these boxes back and fill all this back in, and ready to go. Everything is back in place. 